single drop effects on the mesh before you had to render those in order to see them. Now, let me show you. You can go here. Let's select a Genesis 2 mail. And we are going to drop uh, one of these effects here. Uh, I, I want to say we're going to drop a drop. OK, here. So you see that drop, you don't need to render. It's right there. You can see it right there. And the best thing, you don't need to go to the layer image editor. Open the layer image editor, move it around in, in the UV map, and then go back and render and see if what you move is the correct movement on the is, is the correct place on the model no now now you have the model right there you go to your torso in in the surface uh, tab and you have these two parameters here you have vertical offset and horizontal offset so you do this boom and you move it wherever you need it to be and you're watching it in real time. So you, you have your drop exactly where you need it. No need to go open the layer image editor and start moving it in, in a 2D image to later see how does it look on the model? You have the model right there. You need to uh, go to the face and put a drop. You go here, you look for the face. Uh, and you look for the, the drop that best suits uh, what you want to do. You double click on that. Now you're going to go to the face. There's that drop. See? You're going to go to the face now. You're going to go to the surfaces. And you're going to move that drop wherever you need it. Horizontal offset, vertical offset. And there you have it. Genesis 2 mill is crying. OK? That easy. Exactly where you need it.